today, we've got impossible objects and fiberglass composites leader Owens Corning set to develop fiberglass composites for resin 3D printing. Now the new material they've got coming is set to be released with the possible object's CBAM process. CBAM meaning, meaning basically composite-based additive manufacturing, offering high strength to weight ratios and excellent chemical resistance. Now the two companies aim to create a 3D printable low-cost alternative to metals like aluminum. By combining the CBAM process with Corning's glass non-woven manufacturing expertise, the partnership is expected to bring more composites into the production environment for high strength and high volume applications. The end goal is for the technology to compete with standard manufacturing like injection molding while simultaneously cutting down lead times and tooling costs and also enabling customization. Skinner adds, we have found the impossible objects technology and know-how potentially transformative for the conversion of some applications to composites because we believe it can be successful and deliver true value to the market and our customers, we've entered into a joint agreement to support the development further. Now, the two companies are not alone in their endeavor, of course. Uh, Netherlands-based 3D printing material specialist LitCreate recently released an ultra-rigid ceramic-reinforced composite resin to their photopolymer portfolio. Now that all these patents have been expiring over the last few years, we're really seeing an exponential increase in the materials of the 3D printing world. So make sure you're subscribed as we continue to cover the hottest news stories in additive manufacturing and hit that like button. Thanks for watching and have a positive rest of your day.